if you are suffering from skin discoloration hyperpigmentation or you're just not happy about how your skin looks you want to give it a little life to your skin this is the oil to have and it's very easy to make hello everyone welcome back to my channel this is your girl rama and today we are making papaya oil it can be very essential in our skincare routine depending on what type of skin you're trying to achieve so papaya contains this enzyme called papain so it helps reduce inflammation and control acne if you have acne prone skin it also helps you reduce wrinkles it deeply cleanses your skin it deeply it can help treat skin diseases it helps moisturize your skin to the deepest level it reduces skin pigmentation if you have high hyperpigmentation in areas it will fade that away because this will help you fade away dark spots on your body and it's very very easy to make y'all once you get your papaya cleaned up and peeled i have my um, papaya into this uh, glass bowl and i'm just gonna go ahead and smash it i don't want to blend it because i don't want it to be too smooth i just want kind of like a crush uh, slushy kind of look so you just smash it until you get the desired consistency and it will be ready to be transferred to the stove. So once you got the consistency that you desire, you can transfer your papaya into a pan and you can just go ahead and go from there the oil that i am using today will be extra virgin olive oil and i will use a total of two cups of uh, extra virgin olive oil So just go ahead and pour the oil on top of it and you can move it to the stove. I did pour about half of the oil first and then as this is cooking and the water is going down, I am going to add more oil until I finish all the oil that I want to use for this oil. So as you can see now, this is drying out. You want to cook this on low heat, y'all. You do not want to burn this. You want to cook this on low heat, okay? So when I'm saying water, I mean the juice. You know, this was very juicy. So you want to cook it until all the juice is gone. Once all that juice is gone and it's pretty much dry and you feel like you have transferred all that juiciness into that oil, it is time to drain it. And you just want to let it cool down first, guys. You do not want to burn yourself. And you want to use your whatever you want to use to filter this uh, usually I use like a wig cap or this cheese uh, cheese net whatever and then you just want to just get all the oil out and that is it guys you can apply this oil directly on your skin as it is or you can incorporate it in your skincare routine maybe your your lotion or your butter and you can apply it all over your skin or just in an affected areas that you want to uh, change but you uh, you want to apply this on your whole skin be because this will give a new life to your skin guys this is not skin bleaching this is skin glowing okay <laughs> this, that is it if you have not subscribed to my channel yet please go ahead and click on that subscribe button join the family that is a great way for me to know that you appreciate what I'm doing here and it's also a great way to support my channel and help me grow. So please go ahead and click on that subscribe button, join the family. 
also click on the notification bell so you do not miss more videos for me because i have decided to put more video out for you guys and it's all juicy juicy videos so thank you guys so much for clicking today and please leave me a comment if you have any question and i will see you guys on my next video thank you so much for watching bye